there are some thoughts that, that come through that have a, a, a deeper quality to them than other thoughts. So we're thinking all the time. Our mind is a space that thought arises in and goes out of. It, you know, however, however you want to think about it. And so, so some of those thoughts do have a, yeah, I don't know, it, 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 we could say a more impersonal nature, but I would just say a deeper feeling. And those are the thoughts that I would call wisdom thoughts. And then other thoughts kind of, you know, vanilla. You know, just they, they come through and, and it's like they, you know, they come from a memory. They're, they're what we normally call personal thinking. Mm -hmm. and, and those thoughts don't, don't tend to be as useful um, in terms of navigating life as, as wisdom thoughts. Now, they're all thought. They're all made of the same stuff. And, and whether or not it seems like sometimes like the wisdom thoughts come direct from the spiritual source and the personal thoughts come from the brain. They come from memory. And that's as plausible to me as any other explanation I've heard. Um, but they're all made of the same thing. And, and so to... I, I, really what it is is if you try and go in and, and, and sort, you're in trouble. As soon as you try and go into the content of thought and go, I'll have that one and not that one and that one. It's like if you had a bubble machine, it would be like trying to pick between the bubbles instead of enjoying the beauty of the bubbles and, and seeing that they're all coming from this place.